comments from last night, Gary Belcher. How are you, Gary? Oh, I'm good, thanks, Billy. I guess uh, you and the South Boys will be pretty happy with yourselves after last night. It was quite a task to come back from the week before. Yeah, uh, it was, we did well. I, we did a lot of work during the week on our game, and everyone played well last night. Well, as I did say uh, in a preview for the game last night, that uh, I didn't think that um, play, the, the team could play as badly as they did the week before. There were too many good players here for that to happen. Yeah, well, I, I think everyone realised that too. Well, the, that's where I disagree. Oh, we've got the Canterbury, haven't we? Oh, yes, we've got... What have we got for him? The best gear for you, uh, Gary. There it is. Uh, not necessarily in those colours. You can get any colour you like. $200 worth of the gear. Or for the lady as well. And uh, you can forego yours and put it on the, the lady of your choice if you so wish. Great gear from Kenny. Unfortunately, I've made the excuse there isn't any fruit. Actually, yeah. Uh, the only thing I could get this morning was this one red apple. Stolen from the gateway? Yes, and uh, we won't turn it over, but young Simon George is selling that sort of fruit to the gateway. Not bad fruit time. Keep it up, mate. Uh, here we go. We're but, having a little uh, markets convention yeah, here. It's all right, that's all, but I'll keep it. You're not even one. giving him the apple either. Well, it's a little inferior to my quality, so <laughs> yeah, I'll bring you the good stuff in the summer or come down and see me at the Mullendiner Fruit okay. Market. Okay. Tony, you're forever talking about Canterbury gear and you say that they can't get shirts big enough to fit you. Well, they can't. Well, I've got news for you, boy. Oh, I have hello. one right here. Under your it's been specially brought in from New Zealand. And if this doesn't fit you, I give up. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you're not getting away. <laughs> it's about ten foot wide. <laughs> well, if it's that good, it'll fit over this. Excuse us while we go into this. Tell you what, all Ron I'm... Charles done a, and Carol have done a lot of work to get this over, Mick. They, have they? they? Yes. All I need is the... Took off. up a whole container in a boat. The cap on. Hey, I tell you what, it's not that big. It looked... Hey, excuse me, I can stand up. What's that hump on your back? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, it's not that big, see? You thought it was going to be a giant, didn't you? Look at that, viewers. Yeah, tell, you what, a bit, tell yeah. you what, yes, well, it looks like a nightdress a bit. Thanks very much, Bill. Well, I'll keep that, mate. Tell you what, it might get a bit hot here, but... Thanks very much. Right. Thanks. thanks for coming up, uh, Gary, and all the very best next week, and let's hope it's a good game. Yeah, thanks, Bill. Yes, thanks, thanks very much, Gary. Okay, that's our Canterbury Man of the Match from last night in Gary Belcher. We'll be...